Breaking news! All right, good morning, Uncle Lou here. Uh, yep, yeah, thanks for watching uh, live on YouTube. Breaking news, but it looks like Sony Michelle and Nick Chubb will be returning to UGA for their senior year next season. Now, I'm completely shocked uh, by this. Uh, I I'm not going to lie. I have been saying for months that I thought both of these guys would go pro after their junior year. Uh, both of them are NFL talent, uh, NFL level running backs. Uh, I did not see both of them coming back and staying for their senior year. This is huge news uh, for UGA. Huge news. Uh, you know, regardless, uh, whatever you want to say about the year they had this year, it was a down year for UGA. Their numbers were down um, from previous seasons. I get all that. But that doesn't change the fact that these two guys are elite college running backs. Sony Michelle and Nick Chubb are, this year, were in the top 10 to 15 running backs uh, in America. If you look at just pure time, I'm not talking about stats this year. I'm talking about, just look at where they were projected to go in the draft. Uh, both were projected to go between the third and the fifth round, uh, between the, the eighth and the 15th running back taken somewhere in there. So this is, this is a huge deal. A huge deal uh, for UJ. Now, I never like doing this, uh, but you people force my hand and make me do it. There are some UGA fans. Now, if you if if you follow Uncle Lou on Facebook, then you know I I, I posted uh, a, several hours ago uh, that this was a strong possibility with Chubb and Michelle. That there was a lot of chatter um, going around coming out of Athens about these two coming back for their senior year. You had now. Uh, I mean, this just stretches the, 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 the limits of the mind, what I'm about to tell you here. You, you had, there, there were UGA fans, I mean, more than one, several, in fact, UGA fans that actually said they didn't want Nick Chubb and Sony Michelle to come back. They wanted them to go pro because they're afraid if Nick Chubb and Sony Michelle come back for their senior year, we might lose one of our running back recruits this coming in in 2017. Uh, are you kidding me? Are you kidding me right now? <laughs> so, you want to trade two proven elite NFL talent running backs for two kids that right now are in PE class playing dodgeball in, in a high school somewhere that may or may not be good in college at some point in the future, down the road, eventually, at some point in time. That's what you're telling me. I mean, this boggles the mind. This is the most, it's this sort of backwards mindset thinking from certain people that, that, that just irritates me to no end. How in the hell? You know what it is? It, it, these people, they're always looking for the next thing. They don't care what we have now. What's the next thing? You, there are people that are already drooling all over their Fruit Loops about Jake Frome starting next year. Jake Frome is not starting! Jacob Eason is the starter. I don't understand this infatuation that some fans get with incoming freshmen. I don't understand it. Now, I got caught up on the Jacob Eason hype train, but there was a lot of factors that went into that. Not the least of which was two years in a row of some of the worst quarterback play that UGA has seen in 30 years. Okay? Well, from Hudson Mason and Grayson Lambert. But to, to this, this incessant whining about the next freshman, listen to me, listen. You, you don't win big games playing freshmen. It doesn't, that doesn't happen. Now, I hate Ohio State. I can't stand them, okay? But they're top two, three recruiting class every year. And guess what? They're redshirting 21 players this year. 21! And you got these UJ fans saying, no, 
get rid of Nick Chubb and Sony Michelle because we don't want to run off this running back recruits that we got coming in for 2017. Screw the running back recruits coming in for 2017. Nick Chubb and Sony Michelle have been at UJ for three years. What about them? You can, this makes no sense. I mean, it just, it just, it it makes absolutely no sense at all. It's these same people that spent half the year crying about Nicole Hardman, number one rated athlete or whatever that, that we got, that was a freshman this year. He's a defensive back, he can play some receiver, he can return some kicks, whatever. He didn't see the field, he was on special teams a little bit this year. And every week, where are they going to play Nicole Hardman? He's a beast. What are they going to play? Listen, listen. Just because your cousin went to high school with somebody doesn't mean he's the next Hall of Famer. Freshmen don't play for a reason. Week in and week out, Nicole Hardman, Nicole Hardman. Why aren't they playing Nicole Hardman? I don't understand. Why aren't they playing Nicole Hardman? My cousin's neighbor was in elementary school with Nicole Hardman's third cousin, and Nicole Hardman's the real deal. Well, guess what? McCall Harmon got his chance against the directional school we played the next to the last week of the year. Well, the cream puff we played. We got up big in the fourth quarter. McCall Harmon finally gets in. Now, guess what they did? McCall Harmon got burned six plays in a row. And they went right down the field and scored. They threw it at McCall Harmon six times in a row. The first five were completions for first downs. The sixth one was a touchdown pass. Six plays in a row. Look. If they, somebody's not playing, it's usually a reason. Now, I mean, Cole Harmon will probably be a great player this coming up year or the next year or whatever. But you constantly worried about the next thing we're getting. Screw that. What about the guys with Sony Michelle and Nick Chubb are good now? With the, with the, we're not, they're not playing on potential. They've proven it for three years. Uh, I don't want them. They need to go. I don't want them because the, what, what if Tony Carter and DeAndre Swift, they, they ain't going to want to sit on the bench. Well, then, well then bye. 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 Now, I want them too. Don't get me wrong. I want those guys. But if they're committed to the G, then they'll enroll at Georgia regardless of what Sony Michelle and Nick Chubb decide to do. People are out of your mind. <laughs> anyway, uh, if you're not UGA, you're screwed for next year. I don't know what else to tell you.